Hey everybody, it's Blue Ducky, and welcome back to another episode of Toy Talk. Max here. Let's get started. I can't wait. New Enchantables. You know I love some Enchantables news. Yep. Here, some <laughs> the first couple pictures are some cute pictures. Uh, I think the one on the left is the cute the lamb. Mm -hmm. The one on the right, I think even in the promo picture, doesn't look good with her uh, her snout. Mm -hmm. the, the paint. It just doesn't look good to me. Oh, okay. I like the pumpkins. The backgrounds are really colorful. And then we have the peacock girl and the koala girl. And then um, some ones we've seen already, but then there's the this panda girl, which I haven't seen too many yeah, pictures of. Yeah, she's in the playset. Oh, she's cute. You think? Yeah. Okay. Here's a look at um, a starfish-themed enchantamal. Now, she has a plastic skirt. Is she look. Is she the same size, or does she look a little smaller than the other ones? Uh, I would have to see her next to another doll. She looks smaller in this picture, but okay, I have well, no reference. Well, here is a bad sign right away. I actually like the vanity. The vanity looks really cool. It's nice designed. Mm -hmm. And the little seat. I like that a lot. Yeah. The doll though, it's a plastic skirt along with the plastic top. Mm -hmm. So that's not a good sign. Mm -hmm. And then the starfish is just okay. She looks really plain to me. Yeah. Very, very plain. I think she's gonna have it, it, it would seemed to me like she would have a hard time sitting down with a plastic skirt shaped the way it is on that seat. And this is just a little disclaimer. I'm hard on the Enchantables and Mattel, but I want them to do good. I really do. I want some quality Enchantables dolls. I want there to be good stuff. Uh, but that is not a good sign to me. Mm. And then there's this one. <laughs> I think this one's cute. I like the elephant um, companion to her. Uh, her ears to me kind of look more like mouse ears on the doll, but I really like her little um, elephant that she comes with. With the yeah, the elephant decorations. I like, but what about the actual enchantable character, the doll? I don't think she looks very good. The only thing I think is that her ears remind me more of mouse ears than yeah, she, elephant ears. she definitely looks like a mouse to me, too. Yeah. Which, an elephant and a mouse kind of is a cute combination that go together. Yeah, um, but that's not intentional. Yeah. <laughs> I like the color of her hair. Yeah. And then, they're, they're making the first boy one, which is awesome. Is it? Is it, though? Yeah. Is it? I think so. No. Yeah. It's not. It's a repaint. Is it? Yeah. Of I'm what? pretty sure. Of what? Monster Family. Of what a Monster Family? One of the wolf boys. Uh, He doesn't have wolf hands or legs, though. But his his head. His head? Yes. Mm, I, I think I'm right. That's a stretch. I think, no, I don't think so. Mm. I have to do a side. I should have done a side by side. Uh, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. Maybe I'm. I can, I'll admit when I'm wrong. But viewers, what do you think? Is this just a repaint of a monster family wolf fam, wolf family boy head? I don't think the ears are the same or the hair. And I know the body's not because this is an abomination all to itself. This is something new. For the body, it's all molded on everything. Ooh, it's this is like, this is like, daring charming levels of bad. The daring charming doll. Yeah. Molded I on pants. I understand that, but um, for me, I've I've come to the conclusion that enchantables is probably not something I'm going to be collecting personally, but for what they are, I think they're cute. And, um... I don't. <laughs> okay. I think everybody knows that. Yes. Uh, I think the designs are pretty cute. I want a cool boy enchantable doll. This is not it. 
This is just using the face mold of the the wolf family. I don't. I really you know, don't think that's that, the wolf guy. I'm going to go get him. I think he's in the next room somewhere. Uh, I'm going. You no. keep talking. I'll be right back. Keep talking, Ducky. <laughs> I'm getting him. Okay. Well, I'm by myself now. Uh, I really like the colors for the parrot girl, and her hair is really colorful. And, um... I actually found it pretty quick. Okay. I'm back. Right. All right, let's take a look here. The hair is different. The ears are smaller on the enchantable guy. And that's not the same face, I don't think. Personally, I don't think it's the same face. Was there another wolf boy? No. Oh, I'm wrong on camera. Oh, well, it's close enough. But I... It, okay, beyond that, I don't like the doll because of the horrible th those are if worse you if you get over your personal dislike and just go with like um, um a non-biased view of them it's not unbiased look at those pants they're not even good painted on pants. all right let's just move on okay the other one's actually okay picture. to give a positive the other three out of those four looked decent Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of color going on there. I like it. Mm -hmm. I don't like her um, shoes. They look horrible. Uh, the parrot, I li really like. That's my favorite enchantable companion so far. Mm -hmm. uh, I like the squirrel girl's skirt. I like that skirt a lot. It's cute. Yeah. Um, uh, maybe my favorite enchantable is this zebra. And the zebra girl. Kind of, yeah. The zebra, I, it's it's close to being something special. Like it's cool, but I like the zebra a lot because oh. the zebra's face isn't squished. Like the deer's face was um kind of like squished a little bit, but the zebra it looks uh, like elongated, like a, a equine's face would be. And then the girl, I like, I just like her. What about this penguin in the playset? I I really like the car. Uh, the enchantable and her little pet isn't my favorite. It doesn't seem to fit the enchantables, the car, the style. I don't know. I think it's super cute. Okay. I don't like the penguin. Now and this then, I like. Really? Yeah. I mean, it's not... I mean, I'm not over the moon for it, but based on the quality of the enchantables pets we got, I prefer them as plush than these little plastic smushed face things. These these really remind me of the plush palace pets. Yeah. I mean, I mean, not all of them are great. I like the bunny. Mm. I like the little peacock, the, the uh, skunk. The bunny so. reminds me of the bunny from um, that movie. Uh, it's like... Uh, I'm still the, the, the movie with the dog and what the dog does when you're not home and there's that bunny in the sewers i forget the name uh, i don't know what it was all white but had that expression secret life of yes pets? secret life of pets just the expression on his face but um he still seemed pretty close uh i don't i don't think i, I don't mean know. his I his know. eyes and his face besides the hair yeah maybe they just cut off this part of the hair I don't think so. All right. Uh, anyway, moving on from Enchantimals. Harley Quinn toddler doll. Yeah, I think they, she did a really good job. I don't really, I'm not a huge fan of the toddler dolls, but out of all of them, I think she's the cutest as a toddler doll. I think they did a really good job with the toddler doll line for um, these Jack specific dolls. I like all of them. I really liked them. The face should the faces and stuff and mm -hmm. i think she's really cute too again here's the giant one picture of the giant harley and then we have this super girl who Awful. was she she's not the jack specific one is she i think she is made by jack specific but she's again 
a different... One of my pet peeves about the doll in this... She's not the one that's in the line that came no, out with Wonder it's Woman. even bigger. Oh, it's even bigger. One of my pet peeves, and I... Well, there's a lot... I have a lot of them about the doll industry. <laughs> Honestly. But I can't stand huge dolls. There's, like, no point to them. There's, they take up so much space... I, there's nothing better about this doll than the smaller one or even the large smaller one this is like 38 inches that's you but that's your opinion I mean if you're if you're Look a girl in. that's like the same size as this and you really like supergirl if you have a doll that's the same size as you that might be really cool to you uh to you as like an adult okay, well male then have a little bit maybe there's no point to it but maybe a little bit better quality then there's like painted on shoes and stuff i know i'm not saying this is great you just said there's like no point to giant dolls and i'm saying I don't to like a little girl there might be a point uh okay but i don't like giant dolls okay but other people do all right that's my point but this one, if you're I think gonna do a giant doll, great. make take advantage of the the medium and do something more special instead of just a bigger doll with less detail. Yeah, I like and less articulation. Like with the the Harley and the Bumblebee and the Wonder Woman, I think they did a really good job. But this one, you said, is even bigger, um, and I would rather get her in the, the slightly smaller size. That looks better. And this is... Is it DC Supergirls? It's not Legos, is it? Uh, I'm it's not the sure. other thing. Maybe Mega it blocks? is Legos. Maybe it is Legos. Nah. Is it Mega Bloks? No, it's Mega Bloks, probably. That's, that's what it's saying, Mega Bloks? Yeah. Uh, yes. Set. Sorry, I had a long day at work. I'm kind of loopy. Uh, here's Justice League. Um, build so, a bear. Yeah, build a bear is getting a lot of costumes and bears that are like sewn in costumes. Now there, I included previous released costumes mm -hmm. to see. I think it's you might as well just get the costume because I don't like the bear at all. So there's so, Batman with this costume, and then you have the bear. Now this is an existing costume that's been out for a while, and then the new. I think these may even be web exclusive for Justice League. Mhm. Mm and there's no Aquaman. Oh. Makes me upset. Bad. Aquaman. Well, maybe um, since they never had any Aquaman stuff, maybe he's gonna be like in a store where you can like. A special uh, thing. I I would hope so, but it's also pretty cl close to Justice League coming out. Well, it's February it comes out? No. When? I think it might be early November. Oh. Like a week or two. two couple. I was thinking of, I think Black Panther comes out in February. Yeah. Here is the, this is, I think, cooler than the actual costume. I like this hoodie. I think it'd be better just to get an outfit for your existing bear. Save some dollars. Yeah. This isn't actually for Justice League, but I like the Batgirl outfit. It's cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Flash. Yeah, I love the Flash. Now, I don't know if this one's new or not. I think the Cyborg might be new coming up soon. This is from Superman? a while ago when they first did the Man of Steel. Supergirl. And Wonder Woman. The outfit versus the bear. Now, and Wonder looks... Woman also had the bear with the two colors on her. The blue and the red bear. Yeah. Which that one was pretty cool. This one is be looks a little bit better than the other two. But I still would I... go with the outfit. Yeah. Or the blue and the red bear. Yeah. Which I don't know if that's still available. Nah. This is definitely for the movie. Well, I mean, it might have been out before. I don't know. I don't think so. And here's the Superman bear. Yeah, he looks a little derpy. <laughs> well, they did. At least he has, like, a... Uh... Superman doesn't smell like that. That's a weird smell. He has a, a smirk. Yeah. They should have done it, gone farther with him and gave him his little 
um, black curl in his That would have been cool. Forehead. Yes. <laughs> I might be tempted then. And then we have some pajamas for Justice League. Oh, yeah. Which, these are definitely not for the movie because they have Green Lantern on them. <laughs> you don't know that. Did you see the movie yet? No, but uh, they don't have any... Okay. They, they... <laughs> I know. You... I'm just kidding. <laughs> they but... have Superman, but... Green Lantern, The Flash, Maybe and Green Batman. Maybe Green Lantern does appear in some form. Okay, but if they were going to make... I, I know. Okay. We... This is a long episode. Yes, because... It's because of me. Yeah. This, I can't believe... They have I a Justin be Bieber. I can't believe I like this bear. Because I'm... Sorry if you're Justin Bieber fans. I'm not a huge fan of Justin Bieber. But Bieber. the bear... Bieber. Bieber. What did I say? I think you were calling him Bieber. No. Justin Bieber. Mm-hmm. I'm um, not that huge fan. Not that his music's not good. Just not... I don't know. He's kind of a little fool of himself a little bit. But I like the bear. <laughs> Sorry. That's like the worst thing to say. You could be like, I'm not a fan of his music. But you're like, no. It's just, his thing's okay. I, he's just full of himself. Yeah. That's Sorry. like the worst thing to say. Sorry. <laughs> I anyway. I like, well, I like the bear. <laughs> uh-huh. It's kind of cool. They put more effort into this bear than they have from some other ones for the Justice League. Mm. Look, it's a quality plush. Mm -hmm. um, I would like it if it didn't say his name on the feet. Yeah, you can easily. The face is interesting. Customize that. Could just put something over the foot. Really? I could? You could. Mm. If you want this cool bear. I would never buy that outfit. Well, maybe everything but the shirt. Maybe. I think, like... If I would think of any celebrity um, to be made into a Build-A-Bear, like, thinking of costumes and everything, my first choice would probably be Katy Perry, because mm. she has, like, some really cool costumes. I'll, I'll take my comment back. My apologies if there's any fans out there. I shouldn't judge people I don't know personally. But so. it's because um, his... I, this is, like, really limited edition, I guess. Oh, there's really? only so many. That's what it said in the email, I think. But it's because of this Purpose World Tour. It's like the two-year anniversary, I think. Okay. So. But I take my comment back. I'm sorry. I shouldn't judge people I don't know. He's a talented person. Okay, viewer comment. Mm-hmm. Zelana Salomon Art. The cape and PJs for the Vulpix look very meh. The Shopkins bab looks cute. Nice faces. I don't know how the wings or hot girl are done. The sculpting leaves a lot to be desired. They could have molded nicer looking wings. And Probably. This, and this is for the um, Build-A-Bear Pokemon Vulpix. Mm-hmm. And we and normally Hawk go Girl. right ahead and order them right away, but I haven't ordered this one. Oh, really? No. Oh, I didn't know. That's okay. I, I mean, it's okay. It's not like my favorite Pokemon ever, so... It'll come around again. They always do. Mm -hmm. um, so, thank you, Solana Salomon, for your comment. Thank you, everybody, for watching this Toy Talk. And uh, we'll see you in the next Toy Talk. Yeah, bye. <laughs>